Perbadanan Prima Malaysia says the slower economic growth this year is an opportunity to attract more private developers to undertake affordable housing projects. According to the state-owned agency, private developers are keen to work with Prima to eliminate the market risk associated with their properties. Through Prima's rent-to-own scheme, the end financing for home buyers is secured to encourage more sales. You ask any developers what's the biggest challenge. The biggest challenge is to make sure they get their sales. And how sales translated is when the buyer can get end financing. You ask any developer today, that is one of the biggest challenge that they face. Where we come in is that they don't even deal with the private developer, uh, the, the, uh, the buyers. They deal with us, Prima. So we underwrite and assume the market risk for them. So they don't have the, 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 the headache of uh, 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 thinking about you know, how, how the market will react towards the product. Okay, so that's a value proposition. On top of that, uh, we actually pay progressively. So that actually reduces their construction costs. You know? Prima, which aims to provide a total of 500,000 homes in the next five years, has already approved 105,000 homes as of December last year. Of the approved homes, Abdul Mutalib expects to see 50 to 60,000 units commence construction by the first half of 2015. In the meantime, Prima will begin evaluating new projects submitted by developers. Abdul Mutalib explains that interested developers must be able to provide homes priced between 100 and 400,000 ringgit. He adds that to work with Prima, developers should not value their land based on the values of surrounding developments to ensure Prima homes can be sold 20% lower than the prevailing market price. Meanwhile, Prima is in the midst of introducing a new construction managing system known as Building Information Modeling or BIM. BIM is an intelligent 3D model-based software which standardizes information throughout all disciplines involved in constructing a building. With the software, planning and design drawings are done in high accuracy to reduce wastage during the construction stage. Projects will be delivered on time as corrective works are minimal. Starting this September, the use of BIM will be made mandatory for those who wish to work with Prima. Last week, Prima began receiving applications for seven projects including in Kuala Lumpur, Pera, Kedah and Johor. 890,000 home buyers have registered for Prima housing nationwide thus far. Applications can be made online at prima.my before it closes on February 28th. Jacqueline Peng, DHTV.